Alrighty, hello guys, welcome to Faces back to another Stormworks build and rescue video. I'm sorry that all of my recent videos are on this boat, uh, but essentially that is kind of what I've been wanting to do. This is what I've been interested in doing uh, for quite a while now, so this is what we're building. Anyway, uh, there is something that I want to change, and it might end up changing the entire ship completely. I'm not sure. But anyway, uh, what I want to do is I want to actually lower this entire section where it bends down and round. We're going to lower it down. We're going to make this straight edge come a little bit further down. Uh, we're going to make this come further down as well. And essentially, we're just going to have it be a little bit deeper in the water. Um, that then allows us to put some ballast tanks in. So we'll have a middle ballast tank. We'll have a, a front ballast tank and a rear ballast tank. As well as separate ones on each side as well. Um, so that's what we're going to do today. We're going to add ballast tanks and we're going to lower the entire ship. Maybe. <laughs> Okay, so I don't know how this is going to go. I, I really don't. But anyway, go ahead and grab the selection grid. Go ahead and put it right there. Uh, oh, this makes it even worse. So if I actually drag it upwards and outwards, we actually have to grab this entire section to grab that bit. Oh, that's annoying. That's really annoying. Anyway, right, drag this out wide, wide ways, sideways. There we go. Do it the same over here as well. Out the side. There we go. Very nice. And, yeah, we actually want to drop it, so we grab the entire ship. All right, nice. Good. Yeah. All right, if we go to the back, are we actually grabbing all the engines there? I think we are. I think we might be. Okay, very good. We're literally just going to cut this. We're going to move it down a good chunk. Like, that much. Yeah. All right, we've lowered it down that much. That makes things very interesting, because at the front... This isn't going to look right at all. Uh, it's not going to look right at all. Yeah. So, right there, we're going to have a few issues. But other than that, we should be good. All right, paste it in. Yes. Okay, we're going to go with the yellow all the way down. Whee! All the way backwards. Yes. Okay, very nice. This is going to make it much taller, which I don't know whether is a good thing or a bad thing, actually. I don't know. Alright, so that's kind of where we're at right now. Um, that is actually okay. That's a very interesting looking ship. Um, if we make this bit go flat here, we might actually be able to put a bulbous bow on it and it might actually look okay being flat. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to actually just continue this around and make this entire section really, 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 really boring and flat. Uh, I don't know whether it's going to look good at all. In fact, I'm assuming it's not going to look good. But I genuinely just don't really know. So, we're going to continue this outwards, out to the side. Alright, this piece as well. Yes! And this piece. Alright, good. And then we want all of these pieces doing exactly the same thing. There we go. Up, up, and up away! There we go. Very good. Nice. Alright, this little section right here. Upwards as well. Delete that little piece right there, and that little piece too. Yeah, okay, that kind of works. Do we want it to be yellow, though? Or do we actually want it to just continue the, the red? Because all of that piece could just be red. But is that too much red? I'm not sure. I actually don't know. Do we keep it like that? I don't know. I think that actually doesn't look too bad. Even though that bit is so flat and this bit just isn't. I don't know. Right, go to the back. We're going to do exactly the same thing back here. Let's see what it looks like. Oh, and also, if you're wondering why it wasn't such a difficult choice for me to actually do this, um, the rear propellers actually ended up coming out of the water a lot, uh, and that was an issue when we were driving in the waves. So, the fact that they're so much lower now is actually a very, very good thing. However, if we don't add enough weight, then uh, this thing is going to be too buoyant, and it's going to fall over and... Yeah, look at it. Look at it, dude. I mean, that just took off. The boat literally just took off. Uh, but that is essentially what we want it like, so that's good. Yeah, I'm actually going to keep it the way I've just built it now. We're going to delete every single one of these little pivots that we've put in to make it float better. And we're going to raise them up. Yeah, so delete every single one of these. Every single one of those. Uh, very nice. Same on that side, it's already done. Uh, these pieces need fixing. Um, delete all of these. Okay, delete all of these. Good. All of these pipes need connecting together. There's actually so much that we need to do now. It's unbelievable. 
I can't even connect all of these together. What the heck? Why the heck? There we go. Delete all of those. Delete all of these. And, yeah, connect all these pipes together. Wow, I didn't realize there were so many. Okay, you know what? Before we actually attach all the pipes together, let's spawn it in now that we don't have that glitch going on. Uh, and we'll see how deep it actually sits in the water. Because it might sit, it might sit okay. Uh, it doesn't sit too bad. We're going to move the fuel tank backwards, because at the moment the fuel tank's at the very front. Uh, so we'll move that backwards. And then it should actually sit pretty nicely, maybe. And that's without any ballast tanks or anything, so we can add ballast tanks too. Alright, cool. Uh, so this is obviously... Alright, delete these. Delete these pieces and all of these pieces. There we go, good. We're going to move this forwards, so let's go ahead and grab it. Here we go. Um, clear, reset grid. Yep, grab this. Yep, very nice. Drag it sideways, drag it sideways, and drag it downwards. There we go. Alright, so... We just want the tank itself. We don't need the floor or anything like that. Uh, drag it sideways. Good. And drag it backwards. Yep. All the way to the wall. But we don't need the wall. Yep. Alright, that's it. Cool. Cut it. Cut it. Move it for... Actually, we kind of need the flooring. Uh, that's fine. Whatever. Alright, move this backwards. All the way to... You know what? Actually. Turn it around. We'll put it there. We'll put it right there. There we go, paste it right there, merge this together, like that, and that'll be fine. We also then need to get rid of all of this mess that's going on. So delete all of these backwards to there. Alright, awesome. Delete all of these. Oh god, there's so many. There is actually legitimately so many. Alright, fill this in. Fill this in all the way back to there. Good. Fill this in all the way forwards. And that's okay. Good. Yes. Alright, now we just need all of these things to work. But realistically, this should be very easy. Alright, delete those. Delete that. Put this in. There we go. Um, okay, fill these in. Yes. Angle. Alright, we're just going to shove this in here like this. Very good. That as well. Right there. Should be doing it on both sides, which it is. These two are then going to come in from this side. Alright, that makes sense. Right, fluid. Do, 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 do. One, two. So that's only two of the engines out of all of the engines. We need more. Okay, so we are going to do it the way I said. We're going to drag these around this way. They're then both going to go this way. And then they're both going to go inwards. Uh, through here. And through here. And then I guess they're just going to go up. And attach onto this. That makes sense, I think. Yeah, that's fine. Alright, cool. Grab this. Put it there. Turn, turn it around. Is that right? Yeah, that's right. All right, cool. Nice. Go ahead and make it come forwards. Like so. All right, very good. This one's going to have to come out here as well. However, that one turns first. There we go. And this one turns as well. And then we just need some straight pipes to attach it to there. And some straight pipes to attach it to there. Yeah. All right, put that there. Put these here. Grab some angled pieces. Pop them on. One there, one there. Paint all of this. Because it needs painting. There we go indeed. Alright, very nice. That's our fuel tanks actually set up. Which is beautiful. Alright, jug this, 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 and that. There we go. That's all done. Nice. Alright, cool. That is actually looking good. Let's go ahead and spawn it in. See what it sits like now that our fuel's been moved backwards. Uh, it should sit a lot nicer in the water, I think. Here we go. Indeed it does. That's pretty awesome, actually. I like that. Maybe we don't even need ballast tanks. I'm not sure. Alright, now it's time to literally just attach all of these pipes back together. Because at the moment, they're a bit messy, aren't they? They're a little bit messy. Attach those ones. That's pretty good. Uh, go to the back. Attach these ones together also. Here we go. Yep. Down to there. That'd be pretty epic. Alright, these gearboxes are going to be separated just a little bit. That's fine. Everything literally just needs to go upwards. So, I'm going to go ahead and focus on doing all of these, and I'll be back with you guys very soon. Okay, that didn't actually seem too bad. Let's go ahead and spawn it in, see if it works. If it does work, then we're good. If it doesn't work, then we are bad. But anyway, uh, go ahead and get inside the bridge. Oh, God. Oh, God, I'm breaking things. Okay. Okay, I'm in the bridge. I think I'm in. All right, cool. Go! Here we go. Engine still start. Engine still run. 
We fire our front end out of the water instantly. Okay. But it works. It actually works. It's a little bit unstable now too. So yeah, maybe ballast tanks are a good idea. We'll fill the front one when we're moving. When we're not moving, we'll empty the front one. And that'll be it, I think. Maybe? I don't know. I'm not very good with ballast tank systems, but that's fine. Anyway, uh, we're still moving, so that's good. Let's put the waves on and see how it acts with the waves. Because the back end shouldn't act... Oh. Yeah, we are, we're going to need some sort of stability system. We are going to need some sort of stability system. That's fine, though. That is actually fine. Because now, our propellers don't actually come out of the water all the time. Which is perfect. That's really good. Okay, so we are actually going to change one more thing really quickly. We're going to make it back to Frantic Red. We're actually going to change it back to Frantic Red. Uh, for reasons unknown. I don't know. I'm just changing the color all the time just to see what happens. Now, there is actually a good part about this as well. Is that the back end is very flat now. And if we fill up a ballast at the back, we should be able to lower the back end enough for a boat to actually drive in. So... If we delete, let's say, this section right here, um, we move the batteries, because obviously we've got batteries back here. Wait, 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 wait. Actually, just fill in this piece. That one piece right there is all we needed to fill. All right, that's good. That's very nice, because then we can empty the middle section, all of this. Uh, we can move this one battery, the singular battery, could it? Move it somewhere. Here we go. Forwards. Yep, 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 yep. We're going to put it right there. Right, right, right there. We're going to put it right there. All right, merge it. There we go. Good. So, that is actually fine. That allows us to push in a little bit. Uh, these things need moving sideways slightly. And then a boat can actually come in here and, and rest in here. And that would be pretty epic. That could be pretty epic. It's going to have to be very skinny, though, if this is going to be it. It's going to have to be a pretty skinny boat. It really is. There we go. Look at that. Yeah. So that's going to be the entrance on the back. It's going to be a very, very skinny boat. There we go. Yeah. Uh, obviously, that then means that we should delete this section. And we should fill in this section full of this. There we go. How deep do we want it to come into the... About there, I think. Yeah, about there. All right, cool. Delete all of these. Bring this from here backwards. To there. Fill this in as well. There we go. The boat can't be that deep. It can't be that deep. It's going to be quite deep, but not that deep. You know? Alright, bring it through to here. Alright. Go from there, downwards. Okay, that's pretty epic. That's pretty good. We just need to move the pipes that are in the way, out of the way. And then this will actually work pretty nicely. I think. Yeah, this could actually look pretty cool. Right, I'm going to move these sideways then, and then we're going to get on with it. Okay, so literally just grab this. Uh, yeah, okay, move it upwards. Grab that piece, grab all of this line. Uh, all the way to there. All right, cool. Drag it downwards to a till a point. To about there. All right, cool. Cut that. All right. Move it sideways to about that much. Yeah, all right, that actually fits quite well. All right, paste that in right there. Uh, yeah, we're going to have to attach that again, but that's fine. All right, good. Yeah, move it over to the other side. We're going to cut this one as well. As well. Cut it. All right, move it sideways. Just a, a tinsy wincy bit. It's a ickle bickle bit. There we go. To there. And paste it. Okay, good. Good, good, good. All right, so delete this section right here. There we go. Obviously, fill that right there. That's good. Get an angled piece, if we can. All right, hold on. Pipe. Yeah, grab an angled piece. Put that right there. Sideways. Sure, we're just going to do a zigzaggy one, just because I can. Uh, we're going to put that to there. Attach these together. Voila! Okay, merge this with this. Uh, merge this with this. And then finally, we need to figure out this one. So, delete these. All the way down. All right. Get an angled pipe. Oh, this needs to move too. Ah, this is fine though. Here we go. We just need some angled pipes to go sideways. That's literally all we need to do. There we go. Very good. Make this go sideways. And 
actually go sideways this time. Very nice. And then go upwards. Yeah. All right, pretty good. That's pretty good. All right, upwards. Here we go, to a point. So literally where it needs to be. Come on. Why isn't it? I hate when the, the pipes do that. There we go. Grab this pipe, put it there. Oh, yes. All right, cool. So that's actually been implemented quite well. Delete this, this, and this. We then need to replace those with these, but make them gray. All right, so that's going to go there. This is going to go here. And then... That's all right. Yeah. Okay. Delete all of this up to there. Grab ourselves some straight pipes, like these ones. Put that in there. Drag these downwards. And fill them in. Here we go. Whee! All the way backwards to there. Drag this up to here. And now we've actually got a fully sealed off bit for a boat. I think. Just want it in. See if it sinks. If it sinks, then obviously we don't. If it doesn't sink, we are good. Alright, turn the wind off. Turn the wind. Off. Turn the wind off. No. Lay flat, please. Hold on. Spawn it in. Good. Come on. Yes. Alright, sit flat, please. That'd be great. That'd be fantastic. So, if we had a boat, we'd be able to drive it up to here. We need this bottom bit to be like a little bit more of a ramp. But then, if we have a full ballast on the back, we'll be able to sink the back end. Drive a boat in, raise the back end again, and drive off. Yes! Alright, I like it. We're not going to work too much on this for right now, though. Um, yeah, we're not. We're not going to work on this for, for right now. But it is pretty cool. It's a good idea. Um, when I say we're not going to work on it, we're going to work on it a little bit. So, we're going to have a thing there. We're going to have a thing. Uh, let me work this out. One there. One there. One there. One there. And then one at the end. All right, cool. So, there are actually going to be anchor points on here uh, for each little bit of the boat. So, we can actually, like, carry a boat if we need to, which, to me, seems really interesting and really cool. Uh, we also need a winch, and I'm thinking a big boy one, but that is huge. That is literally mahoosive. That's too big. This winch is too big, but it fits. Oh, if it fits, it sits, dude. We're going to keep it. Oh, we are going to keep it. It's a big winch. That is a big winch, though. Might be too big. I don't know. Uh, we'll keep it for now, but that is pretty cool. Uh, let's go ahead and level off this. When I say level off, I mean we're going to make it... We're going to make it into a ramp. We are. So we're going to start with uh, fixing up these two here. Good. Drag. Oh, no. I didn't mean to do that. Put this piece right here, like so. So it's quite a steep ramp to begin with. Then we're going to go straight in with these. And that, then it's going to be like quite a shallow ramp. And that's all we need to do, I think. Yeah, so we'll actually be able to ride up into it. That's pretty awesome. That is pretty awesome. I like it. Dude, I love what we've got with this boat. It's awesome. Um, right, okay. So I think I'm actually going to leave this one here. I don't know. Have we done too much? We have. We've actually done quite a lot. There's not really too much changes. I suppose there is. We've made the boat twice as tall by just just raising it. That's pretty awesome. Um, next time, we're going to do the ballast system. Now, I don't know where the tanks should go. We don't really have room for them. Maybe a whole side wall thing could go on here? I'm not sure. But um, we do. We need rear, tank rear ballast tanks. We need side ballast tanks, we need some ballast tanks in the front too, so that when we when we start driving, the front end doesn't just go wildly in the sky. Um, but yeah, for right now, I'm going to leave it like this. Thank you guys very much for watching. Um, I was going to leave it red, but actually we're going to change it to blue. We're going to change it to blue. There we go. Look at that, a blue ship. But like a blue, blue ship. There we go. We'll use this. Oh, no, we won't. No, we won't. We'll use this blue. There we go. That actually looks pretty cool. Uh, we'll leave it like that for now. Uh, we'll change the color again soon. Doesn't really matter. But um, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and say thank you guys very much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.